Welcome back, guys, to The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom, where last episode, reaching the Jabul Waters area, we checked out Seaside Village and delivered a grilled fish after a little trial and error before trying out an acorn-gathering minigame upstream. After meeting our first Sea Zora, we now head to their domain. He's over here. Mapping a little bits of places. There's a big fish in the ground. This is Zora's place. Hi. Oh, hi, Lin. I'm impressed you were able to swim all the way out here. Do you have business in our village? If so, you'll find the entrance down there. I'm sure it's non suffocatey Oh, thank God it is. <laughs> you. We're in the Zora Village, the Sea Zora Village. Welcome to Sea Zora Village, our underwater paradise. News of the Jebel Waters area. We're the Sea Zora, the Zora that make our home out here in the waves. Oh. Chief Kushara and the River Zora Chief are having a big tiff. It's going on forever. The longer they squabble, the harder it'll be for them to make up. See, there's the thing we've got to wonder is how much of this is related to going forward. Should we have gone forward first? Should we have come here to then enable us to go forward? We've got to find out. All Zora everywhere love music, and so does the great spirit, Lord Jabu Jabu. That's why we in the River Clan get together to offer our music to Lord Jabu Jabu. But right now he's behaving so wildly that it'd be difficult to stage a performance for him. What do you sell? Potions, for the most part. Ooh. Welcome, man. Anything I can help you with? Oh. Our leader, Chief Kushara, has our full love and respect. Uh -huh. I'm confident that she'll resolve these troubles with Lord Jabu Jabu quickly. Anything up there for me to grab? Ah, oh. oh, guess what? My friend went off to want to play adventure. Why don't I stay here? I want to play too. Yeah. Lord Jabba Jabba is always graced to see you with his blessings. We take excellent care of the sea, so why would he go wild now? Oh. It's one problem after another. That large rift and now Lord Jabba Jabba's behavior too. Perhaps my first step is to send an attendant to Lord Jabba Jabba's den to look into the rift. No, no, thank you for the cheers. Great start. Yeah, that's the thing, we've barely started with this game at all. <laughs> Look, it's a light fish. Not that bad. Come on, guys. Can actually talk to me. Oh. I adore Chief Kushar. I have so much respect for her. She's perfect in every way and always looks for our clan. Or out for our clan. The sight of her inspires me. <sighs> it's beyond belief, Lord Jabba Jabba went wild at the same time that huge rift appeared. So much at once, Chief. That rampage alone is hard to fathom. He's never done that. Indeed, that's why we should proceed carefully or we could make things worse. We must put a stop to Lord Jabu Jabu's erratic behavior. In time, we'll need to investigate that rift in Lord Jabu Jabu's den. I don't think we need these guys to forward things then. Well, if that's the case, and we've come to here. We've got another warp from having gone that way, so that's not too bad. The only other thing I can see is trying to, like, climb up the wall to go higher into that area. And we'll continue on towards the giant rift. We're right outside it. Doesn't seem that I need to speak to any of the Zora. For progress purposes. In fact, we could just head in. Well, partly. That's the giant rift that I spotted earlier. Let's investigate. Right, we can just go straight in. Yep. There's no reason not to. No opposition to our entry. That baffles me. Yep. Ah. Two buttons to press? Like statues needed or something? Yeah, you can go in, I can't. I can make the rift entrance back there. Let's go farther inside, Zelda. Uh. Oh yeah, it looks like this place got swallowed up bad by the rift. Hold on, who's this? 
I bet you came here because you're worried about Lord Jabu Jabu, huh? Uh... I know we are. He's been running wild all over the place since this rift spread in his den. Yeah, we got here fast as we could see what's going on with him. To see. Uh... Huh, you want to get in his den? Oh. To open the door, the chiefs of the River Clan and the Sea Clan must play music here together. So not statues, literally people that we have to get to come over. River Clan. Oh. We're in the River Clan, you know us being rivers or and all. Our village is north of here. Hey, you should visit us up river sometime. Oh. Anything else you want to know? I've been to the Sea Clan. Oh. The Sea Clan are all Sea Zor. As you might have guessed, they're Zor who live in the sea. Their village is south of here. That's an island with a huge fish tail sticking straight up. Oh. Anything else you want to know? No, that's it. Ah. If you want the chiefs to play music here, you'll have to go to each village and ask them. But, um, we're in a hurry. Ah, we had to go here first. Ah. The rift appearing, Lord Jabba Jabba being on the rampage. A lot's going wrong. And our chiefs are squabbling on top of it all. Oh, it used to be so peaceful around here. Ah. This is Lord Jabba Jabba's den, but we can't get back there right now. Oh. To open the door, the chiefs of the River Clan and the Sea Clan must play music here together. What are you doing, though? Ah. Me? I'm watching over Lord Jabba Jabba's den. The sea Clan and the River Clan take turns doing this. We're from the river. <laughs> Our chiefs are at each other's gills, but the rest of us get along pretty well. Do they love each other or something? Yep. They're squabbling. <laughs> well, I guess we... Found this place at the right time, in a certain sense. Yes, we may have done it slightly wrong order. But we know where one is. So we can go there without any issue. The big fish. Why are they squabbling? And what am I obviously going to end up doing to help them? This is a grave situation. First that rift, now Lord Jabu Jabu going wild. Lord Jabu Jabu is the spirit of Ulzora, but it falls to us to calm him. This crisis is without equal. Now it's time that I, Kushar of the Caesar, resolve it. Chief, what inspiring words. Please tell me how you plan to do it. Lord Jabu Jabu loves our sea music, so I need only get him to listen to us perform. And then Drad, that tuneless buffoon, will have to applaud my performance. Ooh. I take it that you haven't resolved your latest quarrel with the other chief yet. Aww. And why would I? This quarrel is one for the ages. I will never speak to him again. He insulted my music. I will not tolerate his presence. Ooh. It's like he lives to provoke me. Oh, we'd be fine if he agreed that I was more talented. <sighs> never mind all that. We have to leave immediately, Rogma. Oh, greetings, Hylian. I'm on my way out. Your business will need to wait. Hmm. Did you have a request of our chief? I'm sorry to say that until she's resolved our problems, she won't have time to help. Hmm. If our great crisis wasn't bad enough, our chief is quarreling with the rivers or chief. They often have their little quarrels, but always make up quickly. Not this time. Hmm. What's the saying? A squabble a day keeps a friendship in play. Such nonsense. Well, stranger, I shouldn't burn you with our troubles. Uh, Rockman, please, we must be off to Crosslow's Plaza. Uh, yes, at once. Hmm. If you'll excuse me. Squabble, what a strange word. I don't understand what it means. But I do know that we'll never reach that rift until the two chiefs hear out our request. Yeah. It's always such a pleasure to be in Chief Kushara's presence when she's here. Then I have an option to ask where she's gone. <laughs> Just in case we went off and did other exploring. Now you've come here, but where exactly here are we talking? Hmm. How go the preparations for our musical performance, Rogma? Not quite ready yet, Chief. Performing is a superb idea, but are you sure we shouldn't invite the River Clan? We've always played here with them, both clans in unison. <laughs> Forget that nonsense, I can finally show Drad which one of us is truly marvellous. Mm. Now let's discuss what music to perform. They're not going to pay any attention to us, are they? Maybe we should go to the other Chief and ask for help. 
So we've got one in position. It's about getting the second one now. Now I'm assuming if we just head on past the den, we'll be on the right road to where we need to go. So this away. Should be able to take out all fish around without any issue. There's a stamp bit though. Is that a cat or a dog? Art is in the eye of the beholder after all. I have no clue what the intention is. Oh, come on. I thought moving you... I thought I made a play out. I thought I moved him in front of the projectile. He was going to get got one. No hidden bits behind the waterfalls as of yet. in here, however. It might be a bit rifty. Do not disturb the bomb fish. I have disturbed it. And now I have learnt bombs, but in fish form. <laughs> this dangerous fish explodes at the slightest impact and is capable of breaking weakened walls. Even if it's above ground? Danger, do not proceed past this point. Oh, well, I lost the sign now, so... Sorry, I can't read. Just charges at them and... I if I can do things with broken walls now, like properly bomb stuff. Fish doesn't seem very active on its own. I can just put it on the ground and it will blow the stuff up for me. That's kind of cool. You fools! <laughs> I have bombs. Just not in the way I thought I'd have bombs. How do I make you activate? Uh, right. Oh god. <laughs> That's how we make it activate. <laughs> They're just gonna rub their... <laughs> That's... And that's how bumfish mate. Oh, shoot. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Ah! <laughs> you gotta bang its bomb bit into the object and then it explodes. Okay. Once its bomb bit touches. Oh, God. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Fine, I'll be fine here. I 
<laughs> oh, they all bomb together. <laughs> Menage a bomb. <laughs> Beautiful. When exactly as planned. Just had to get rid of the first one first. <laughs> Eh? I gotta come from above? Okay. Go away! Go, go, go away! Go! <laughs> Wait, if their bombs don't hit me... No, I can't blow up the... How am I getting through this wood? Fire? What is my option? That's... Huh. How? Fire? I'm gonna go with fire. I can gain a source of fire from my arrows. Through this. Okay, come here. So if I go... There we go. Oh, I just used all my gauge. And that got me a gold egg. I mean, I always have a way, but I was just wondering if I could use the bomb fish, considering the bomb fish were the puzzle. That was the literal element that we were supposed to be using. And we're done with the place. Seems like this area was for a bomb fish and a golden egg. I'd say I dislike it. Now I'm wondering if I should go use the bum fish to go do some stuff. Seen a couple of places we can break through after all. Dragonflies? They're enemies. Interesting. Somehow, my guys are winning this. Quite handedly. A needle fly echo. Highly intelligent, this large insect is a master of finding the perfect moment to attack. Is it now? I think it could have done a bit better. It might have survived. Seems like one on one that doesn't quite work for them, but uh, I did another number and it seems to work out fine. Well, that's a warp spot. This is the River Zor's village. That does give me the opportunity to go back where there were bombable walls. Where was the other bombable wall? Oh no, I only remember one now. Did I mark the other one? Or am I an idiot? What is going on here? Okay, so I just latch onto this at the right time. It should just naturally drift me onto the switch. Nothing more to think about than that. <laughs> Same kind of scenario. This time I need to gain height. 
Oh, so every time I jump, it will gain the height, to be fair. Because of the way it doesn't reset. <laughs> but I did kind of mess it up. Because it can't go lower than the floor. Jumping just naturally pushes it upwards. And then pull it around and back down. Up to leisure chesto for some quick puzzles. One hundred rupees. We are overjoyed. A silver rupee indeed. All right, a quick set of puzzles gets us a fair bit of goods, and now we've explored even more of that map. Blimmin' hell. I have no clue where that other bumble wall I stole was. Did I see two bumbles or just one bumble wall? Was it there? No. Yeah, no. Where was it? I know that one was there, but... Let's go grab that quick. Where was the other bubble bubble? It's a bigger bubble bubble, wasn't it? A really big one. Can't believe I've managed to... Uh... To completely blank on what I need for this one. It's amazing how the spikes are actually in my... Ow! My most used is what I was about to say. Damn it! <laughs> spider on spider violence again. Just take me up! Thank you! Excellent! Yeah, I thought it would just give me a reward for fighting it. We came here for milk. Old, ancient... Crusty cave milk. Mmm. <laughs> Don't you just love your old cave milk? So tasty. Deliciously unfresh. Cave milk, baby. <laughs> Who doesn't love some cave milk in their stomachs? Tasty, tasty. Cheese. By any other name, it's cheese. At this point, and a festering lump. What would you actually get if you left cheese milk behind for like that long? A new plague, probably. Welcome to the River Zora Village, where friendly hellos and good times flow. At least uh, normally. Lord Jabba Jabba's gone berserk. Now we're all just scared. Fair dues. Ooh. Oh. 350. Zora's flippers. Flippers that resemble Zora fins. You can swim faster while wearing them. Yeah, we definitely want them. Relatively soon. How many different pairs of footwear can I wear at the same time? <laughs> now that I've got three accessories. Oh. Jibble Wards has been full of trouble lately. I like to eat my favourite fruits and times like this. Gotta keep my spirits up. In these fishes. Either not a big village or just multiple tiered compared to the Amazoras. 
My friend can all swim, but I can't do it. I really want to practice, but the war is kind of scary. A really big rift opened up recently in Lord Jabba Jabba's den. His den is in a cave down the river. It's got some bold designs inside and out. I get worried about all the strange stuff lately, like Lord Jabba Jabba being out of control. Like 20 rupees just being hidden underwater. But I would like to find some more heart pieces more. I just think the first area being so thick of them has made me feel like I've found not a lot since then. But it might just be that giving you a heart early kind of thing. Yeah. Something bad's gonna happen with all these risks, I just know it. Hey, calm, return to our waters before it's too late. It's interesting, we can dive underneath your place. Is that your sleeping pen? Pens probably are not a very nice way to put it, <laughs> to be totally fair. Which is most likely to be the chief's house then? I take it as this one. Our oh, people are scared, boss. That huge rift opening. Lord Jabber Jabber on the rampage? Fear yeah. not, I have a plan. When have I, the great Drad, ever let you down? First, I'll get Lord Jabu Jabu nice and relaxed again. Good thing, boss, but how will you do that? With music, of course. River music. That'll stop his rampage. We're just that good. Then that no-talent Kushar will finally bow down to my superior skills. <laughs> Hold on, boss. Why are you still squabbling with the Caesar chief? You two usually make up right away. It's really dragging on this time. Squabbling? This is a big deal. She bought my music. I'll never make up with her. Bah, I'm not going to just sit around. I've got real problems to deal with in an hour. Oh? Who are you? Ah, uh, doesn't matter. It's gotta wait. Oh. Did you need our chief for something? Sorry, Dread is busy. The boss has a lot going on right now. Oh. Doesn't help that he's having his worst squabble ever with a Caesar or a chief. Their fights are usually small, then just fizzle out. This time it's blown up completely. They used to get along so well, too. Yeah, this fight's gone really bad. Oh. Hey, no, what's the order? We've got to get to Crossroads Plaza. Hi. Coming. Ah. Sorry, the bus calls. See ya. I mean, at least they're going to be both at the same place at the same time. It's good for us. They went off to Crossroads Plaza, too. And I guess it's time we join the two chiefs there as well. Yeah. The bus has gone off, leaving me here to keep an eye on things again. I mean, between boss and the chief of the Caesar, yes, I want to know more about the squabble. Those two have been squabbling since they were kids, but this time, yikes. I get that they play music differently, but I hope they hurry and make up soon. Ah. Boss has gone off. Yeah, he has. Well, one thing about boss, though, he trusts me so much, he leaves me here to look after stuff. You're either the second in command, and you can be proud, I guess, or you're just the guy he considers to be the one he can make suck it into it. We just don't know which. Yeah. Ooh. So there's even more of a path. These are rifty kind of lands, though. Yeah. All these rifts everywhere. I just want Khan to return to Jibble Waters. When? When can I just go on a good stroll again? My papa and I found this rift on our walk. Doesn't look that dangerous. Can I touch it a little? <laughs> I would advise against it. You love the use of the horns in the last song? Well, I just wonder exactly what each person's going to be playing instrumentally at this point. And that seems to be the limits of the play area here. I'm assuming that they are horns, but uh, the question comes up as to what the other one is using. Did you just drown?
Gonna dive in around these rifts a bit. Not finding anything though. Doesn't seem to be. We got a little bit of the area mapped out. I'm sure we'll close that rift eventually, so push the kid in for science. Just don't forget about it, I guess. <laughs> what? <laughs> Your dastardly ways are way worse than mine. What's, what's going on with you? Oh. How dare you! <laughs> you shouldn't have come here. I'll take care of Lord Jabba Jabba myself. Get lost! Aww. My fault's precisely. Off with you. <laughs> <laughs> The squabble. Robert said I should come, but I never expected to see the River Zora chief here too. I'm sure this will end badly. Eh? I came here because Drad called me here, but boy, things got messy for the boss. What's gonna happen now? 